I'm Casey Levy. And I'm Brandon Uranowitz. And, and you're, you're watching B-Way Show. Hey everyone, Shoshana reporting for B-Way Show here at Press Day for Leopold Scott. So we are here at Press Day. How are you feeling? The show's coming to Broadway. Yeah, it's pretty exciting. I sort of can't believe it. It feels very surreal. Good. Scared. Pumped. Excited. Terrified. Yeah. Uh, slightly petrified, but uh, uh, also quite grateful. Overwhelmed, excited, thrilled. It's something you dream of all your life. I've never done a play. I've only done musicals. Um, so I already feel like I'm learning and growing. If you were to describe this play to your friends, what would you say? It's, it's, it's very grand and it's very... It's intimate and large at the same time. It's unbelievably special. What I would say is that it's kind of a hard and a fast play. It seems like something that you'd be sitting there for hours and like looking at your watch or whatever, but it's like a slick, hard... It's like being getting on a train that kind of accelerates. Yeah. It's a great emotional play with a good story. Yeah. It's Tom Stoppard's most personal play. Yeah. And because of that, there's, there's just a different resonance. I think what's so exciting about his plays is they're like Russian dolls, you know, like you, you, you get in there and you take the lid off and you're like, oh, there's something else in there. It has this epic scope, but it also really is just about this family. It's a bit of a thrill ride in lots of ways. It doesn't feel like a, a transplant, it feels like something completely new. It's, it's something that everyone can connect to, I do believe. But it's also very, very joyful and there's a lot of fun and humanity and it has everything you want when you go to the theater. You laugh, you cry, hopefully, we'll see. There's dancing, there's beautiful costumes. Uh, it's a proper show. It's got 38 people in it. It's got children, it's got old people, young people, glamour, beauty, and then finally, a lot of pain. My grandparents, my great-grandparents could never have fathomed the life I lead now, yeah. let alone the Jewish life I lead now, or the Jewish representation. It's about remembering these people that had yeah. these incredibly rich lives, and they were stolen from mm -hmm. us. On the whole, if an actor is playing a character who's Jewish, it's been important to cast somebody who's Jewish. I'm usually pretty good at the end of the night when the curtain comes down, sort of letting it go and going home and releasing it all, I, this one is going to be tough. There's something so special about this play. And so many people making their Broadway debuts. That is so exciting. Who, who could that be? Who's that? Oh, who's that? Where? <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's a it's lot of thrilling. us. It's thrilling. Yeah. It's like I'm dreaming. Yeah, it's a very, very unusual and hard thing to compute, but um, I'm having the time of my life. 24 of us. Is it 24? 24. You are veterans. <laughs> I would just say I'm so excited that Broadway is back and is coming back more and more every day and I can't wait to be a part of this story on Broadway. Cleansing. I think it'll just remind people that there is something bigger than themselves and it will move you. It's a really beautiful, uplifting evening in the theatre and it's, it's totally unique. If you haven't seen a play on Broadway in a while, this is the play to come and see. Uh, if you love history, if you love your mind stimulated in a theatre, if you love laughing, and if you love being devastated in your heart, which for me is what theatre is about, then come. See you at the show.